I'm Mark. Thanks for joining me here in my wee workshop in County Down in Northern Ireland. A little mini vid today all about rusty nuts and bolts and an experiment to clean them up. Come on, have a look at this. If you feel and sad and blue, you really don't know just what to do. Hit that mess. Hit that mess. I had seen a lady restoring, I think it was a little toy piano, and she cleaned up all the rusty nuts and bolts on it by using a clever little sort of sand tumbling thing. I haven't got a clever little sand tumbling thing but I have got a clever big sand tumbling thing because some years ago somebody gave me this toy which their kids no longer wanted so of course I got it it's a National Geographic rock tumbler now if it can tumble rocks I wonder could it tumble nuts and bolts and clean them up I have no idea so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get it going and then let it tumble for a while and see if it cleans up the nuts and bolts. It's worth a try. So let's see what's in the rock tumbler box. Well, first of all, there's the a very impressive looking rock tumbling gadget. There it is. I'll put it back here where you can see it. And uh, what else have we got? Oh, it plugs into the mains. Let's start it up and make sure it's actually working. So. Oh, it's going round and round like a washing machine. <laughs> well, you are supposed to be tumbling rocks in this, so maybe a few days at a time is a good idea. But um, I think we'll do this for an hour or so and see how we get on. So let's open it up. Thing of me bob in the inside. And what do you do with this? Oh, you unscrew it. So, um... I have no clue what to do with this so uh, it's all complete guesswork as usual and that's why you tune into this channel to see me make a mess of things of course so there's a bit of um bit of sand in there and now let's just put the nuts and bolts in here's the nuts and bolts let's put them in there they are in there can you see them I can't. So let's let's start it up and just let's just see what happens. Well, the first thing that I noticed was that nothing was happening, it was just skating on the belt. But I'm going to try it again. I think that's got it a bit more now, so what I need is something for it to sit on. Okay, well it's been uh, just over an hour and a half 
So let's go and see what, if anything, this thing has done. Strongly suspect that nothing at all has happened here. <laughs> well, let me see now if I can get that in focus. Well, now, I actually think that that has improved it a little bit. I'm kind of amazed. It has definitely taken off some of the surface rust. Well, I'm going to call that a minor improvement. It hasn't damaged the threads in any way. I'd say another couple of hours might do something. So that's what I'll do. I'll put it on again and we'll come back to it another few hours. I'm going to have some din-dins if you want to stay here and watch it. It's okay with me. Well, it's still going. I made the dinner and burnt everything. But I have finished the dishes without breaking anything. It's now about 8 o'clock, so this has been going continuously for about 3 hours. And that makes a total of 4.5. I think it's about time that we opened it up and have a look. I don't know about you, but I think this has worked out quite well. It's very noisy. And I'm not sure I will ever have the thing going while I'm working ever again. Because the noise was so distracting. I was trying to do some measuring calculations. I just could not concentrate. But it has worked. I think what I'll do next time is leave it running overnight. That way I won't have to listen to all the noise. Well, that's it for this one. Thank you so much for looking in again. Would I advise you to go out and buy a rock tumbler to clean up rusty parts? Uh, no, but if you have something lying around, this is a pretty good way to clean things up. So um, I think we'll call that experiment a success and we'll give it a try on something else and look on it again some other time. In the meantime, thanks so much for watching. God's greatest blessings on you. And um, let's do something like this again real soon. Tea and biscuits. Hit that mess. Ah. Hit that mess. Ah. That's what I'm talking about.